JMV Productions. Like and subscribe. Hey, how's everybody doing today? I'm trying to show you how to use Suno and Udio and get the most out of it using Audacity. This little application is going to show us the waveform of the file. So I'm going to go ahead and download one real quick. So after you download your song from Suno, you just drag it and drop it right into the window, and you can see the wave. The cool thing about the wave is you can see right here, it's quieter than right here. That's, be that's how you tell just by the thickness of the wave. There's more information there, you got more sound. Absence or just a thin line means that there's no sound, like right here. No sound. Cigarettes burn shot. You can use the amplify. And that will max it out. It automatically will put it to the max volume that it can fit in here uh, before it clips. So I'm going to just do five because I don't want it to be completely full. I want to match this wave file so that way they're about the same size. Because if they're about the same size, I can click the whole thing. And now it'll tell me this is the max that my whole file can get amplified to. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And now that I have it at its max file or at its max form. Cigarettes burn shadows in the dark. You just turn your volume down lower, and you get way more of the instruments out of it. Now, I'm going to show you another trick. I'm going to amplify this to negative 15. Now that I got it small, I'm going to use what is a W1 limiter. You have to download this. It's called George Young W1 limiter. and it's the only thing that I have added to Audacity. And this is what does the work here. It makes... Somehow it compresses it, it limits it. I don't really understand it, but it takes the waveform and makes it bigger. And it brings more dynamics to it. So I made it small so that way I can cr really crank it down here. I'm going to go negative 20. Not really sure what that means, but what it does is make my wave way too big there. I gotta back it up. Let's try that again. There we go. So now... Cigarettes burn shadows in the dark This, doing this to your AI music makes it sound so much better, if you can't already tell. But there's more advantages to using Audacity with your AI music. You can also go to your metadata editor and go ahead and put your artist name in here. Your track title. Album title, track number. You get it. You can really make your AI music yours. Put a little comment in there if you want. Let them know that you made it with Suno. 
and then you export it. And you can put it in a wave format, which is actually better quality. It's a lot bigger. It's a lot bigger file wise. The uh, file size is bigger than an MP3, and it's supposed to sound better. MP3s are actually compressed. So, the next thing to show you is when you're using Udio. You can combine these songs. They're only a minute five, minute five. Here's the original one. It was 32 seconds. So if I ran out of credits, let's say, and I wanted to make my song longer, but I didn't have enough credits, or let's say I really liked the verse in version one and version two, and I wanted them to be in the same song, you won't ever be able to generate them together. You'll just have to generate them separate and make them longer individually. But I have already downloaded these. So I'm going to go ahead and take version 1 and version 2 and put them both in there at the same time. Now what's really neat about this is... I can I can load multiple and compare them. Since they're identical, I can play them over top of each other. So, at 32 seconds, I'm going to go ahead and chop it. And I bring this up here, delete this one because we don't need it. Got to trim this right here. And now I have a minute, almost a minute 45 out of those two songs that were a minute five each. When I see audacity spins. Into it. You can listen to it, and there's a lot that you can do to make sure it's clean. It sounds clean because when you zoom way in, I'm zooming way in now, you can see right here it's a little bit choppy, but that's not that bad. I can actually go ahead and chop this. Now see how much cleaner it looks? It's going to be cleaner, too. Well, I hope that made sense. That looks pretty good. Alright, well, that's using Audacity.
free. It's always been free. You just come right in and download it. 